this this right here. Capsule will be right on the surface there, but there's the cortex. You could see some of the uh, cortical radiates coming out, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the veins coming back. Mm -hmm. uh, better over here, actually. Uh, these aren't the best I've ever seen, but these are pyramids. And this pyramid right here, we can um, take some of the latex out of the uh, collecting channels here. I'm going to use my forceps to work with this. I'm going to be working down into the pelvic area right here. This is the pelvis I'm in right now. See, that's the ureter. There's the pelvis right there. What happened? Her phone is dead. <laughs> Look at that minor calyx right there. Okay. There's a pyramid right there with the, um, there's a column sticking in the way, but I'll just have to get it out of the way. There's a pyramid, there's a column, papilla is right there. And there'll be another papilla here we'll see pretty, pretty well too. Um, let's get some of this latex out of here. I'll just cut that off right there because we'll see the ureter going out. This is actually a, a minor calyx right there. Okay. The space is, that is, that the latex pretty much, uh, made a cast of there. Minor calyx is the papilla, pyramid. This is a major calyx, because it's quite large and collecting uh, from different areas. Pelvis, ureter. If you, if you watch, if I, if I um, put this away here, so slice myself or somebody. If you watch when I come through here, you'll see I'll come out right through the ureter that I had before, had shown you before. See? Right there. And notice how grooved that thing is. That's because the ureter is constricted, you know, and it's a little irregular corrugated lining to it. Well, you can see right there the lining. Mm -hmm. So, pyramid, pyramid, column, <coughs> column, pyramid. Column. Column, column. pyramid, pyramid. It's not the greatest I've ever seen, but it's, it's okay. Now, this guy right here, mm -hmm. you wouldn't think it is, but this is a minor calyx right here. And that nipple stick, sticking right, right uh, that tip right there is a papilla. Okay. Let's look on this and see the structure that you just named. This is the cortex. That's the cortex. Pyramid, 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 the darker area. The minor calyx like that, or that. Well, this one is right here. See that right there? Mm -hmm. Or it would be the same here, mm -hmm. just different angles of it. There's another one but facing from another direction. We have the same thing on this model here too. That is a minor calyx and you can see the papilla and you can see that it has holes in it. It's facing in this direction. Everything in this isn't in the, uh, what the plane, the, the uh, frontal plane of, no. Yeah, frontal plane of the kidney. Not everything is in that plane right there comes at a different angles to us. So, there you go. This, um, if you look care carefully, you can tell that this pyramid has ducts in it, can't you? Can't yeah. you see those lines? Mm -hmm. What I wish it had was some of the ones we do have yellow going up into the uh, collecting, well, first of all, the, the uh, papillary ducts and the collecting ducts has 
yellow going up into them. You might see that in some of yours. The latex was under such pressure, it pushed it right up through those ducts. And it's coming cool. Cool. There's another minor. See it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Up in there. It's not uncommon to find kidneys uh, in, the, in pigs and humans too, of course, and other animals as well, with the uh, very significant cyst in them, usually fluid-filled. We had one kidney, a pig kidney, had a cyst that big, Ooh. covering almost one, all one end of the kidney. Mm, wow. mm. Okay. That's cool. What is the cyst? It's just where the um, nephrons and so on had been, uh, had, had died and, and fluid filled the area and it just enlarges into a cyst. Mm. Now there is, a, there is a disease called um, the uh, polycystic disease of the kidneys, uh, where cysts form all through the kidneys progressively and the kidney eventually is destroyed. Mm -hmm. And so the nephrons are destroyed and it ends with renal failure. Is there any cancer in a pig kidney? Yeah, I've never seen it, but I'm sure there has been. I've never noticed any. I don't know. I wonder where this red is coming from. That's uh, blood. That's a natural color of the kidney. This is where it's not preserved real well, maybe. Mm -hmm. But anyway, it's not that difficult, and some of you will get much better pyramids than I got, I'm sure. So, get your kidneys and go to it. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah.